Elizabeth Schellenberg had some doubt the first time she saw her friend Lori urban polling. Initially, I thought it looked so dorky. I thought she was training for cross-country ski season because she's an avid cross-country skier. But she tried it for herself. And now Elizabeth is hooked. Urban polling, also known as Nordic walking, is a simple but effective workout developed in Europe. Now, it is one of the fastest rising trends in North America and can be done year round. You know, at first we were this novelty of people walking with poles, but now it's, it's become more commonplace. Um, I've taught many people in the neighborhood here and different people in the city, and it's not so strange anymore. Now what I'm doing doesn't look like very much, but I'm actually exercising 90% of my muscles and I'm increasing strength in my arms, legs, shoulders, chest and back. It allows those with injuries, like Elizabeth, to still get in a full workout. I love walking, I love jogging, but my knees don't let me jog anymore. And so I find that uh, this just gives my workout a cardiac boost. I can't get myself into my training heart rate um, with walking alone, and this just gets the upper extremity involved. Lori recommends using specific Nordic walking poles rather than hiking poles. Beyond that, no specific equipment is required, making urban polling quick and easy to pick up. Because it's something that anybody can do, it's something that old people can do, young people can do. Um, if you're looking to add some extra stability, if you're trouble balancing, then that's a nice thing to have the poles in your hands. Lori says her and a friend were the first ones to do it in Winnipeg about a decade ago. She continues to spot more people picking up the poles. Anytime that I'm driving down Lindale, which is close to where we live, uh, somebody's out there walking. And sometimes they're people that I've taught and sometimes they're people that I don't know. And for Elizabeth, her original thoughts about urban polling have taken a turn. Give yourself a couple of tries to get used to it and uh, there's no going back, you'll love it. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Kevin Hirschfield.